Mark Faree and Lou is hanging out with a very couple of special guests from the Animal Rescue League of Iowa. As we learn, it's a last chance for great pets, and we have a wonderful dog we want to introduce you to this morning. This so take it away, so Lou. This is so cool. This is an awesome dog. This is Timmy. No, not, not Lassie. Timmy on this end. But uh, Goizani is here from the Animal Rescue League of Iowa. What a cool dog. Yeah, he's pretty cool. Um, he is, like you see, pretty happy guy, very mm -hmm. bouncy, mm -hmm. um, loves to play. Um, he's three years old and um, he's an American um, bull terrier. Okay. And um, he knows how to Here sit and lay nice. down and likes to he play with tennis balls. And, and likes like our homemade treats, which is good. Um, oh, look, he's watching Jackie. Uh, he's, he's very attentive to Jackie <laughs> as she's walking by behind the camera. But um, how, do we know how we uh, got the uh, the dog at the rescue lane? You know, uh, to be honest, I don't. You don't? Okay. Yeah, no, I'm not very sure. But he's a strong dog. That's one thing to keep in mind. He is a strong dog. So little kids, you probably don't want to have little kids around, right? That's right. Yeah, we prefer an adult um, home, mm -hmm. uh, adult-only home. And um, he's definitely active, so he definitely needs an active family. Tim Timmy, come here. Timmy, come here. Timmy, Timmy. Someone that sit. would like to take him out Timmy, and sit. play with him. Timmy, pay attention. Sit. You're on TV. Sit. There Good we boy. go, Good boy. boy. <laughs> See, that's a, you're right. He does listen to what he's what he's talking to. But, he's but these kind of dogs, right now. Now, he, he, he the kind of dog would need a yard or would need a, just a bunch of walks. Yeah, well, you know, to be honest, preferably both. Okay. <laughs> um, but, you know, I will definitely he benefit from walks and even maybe some runs mm -hmm. um, every day. Just He's an active guy and he'll definitely need some exercise. Right. So, right. Yeah. That's what chills them out when they have a chance to run around like that. That's right. It? Yeah. yeah. But he'll settle down. He likes his stomach rubbed and belly rubbed yes, and things like does. that. So we'll we'll show you that here in just a couple of minutes. But uh, so that's our little uh, our little doggy that we need to get a home for here oh. this weekend. So we'll try to do that here. There, just here, here rub your tummy. <laughs> you got your hook your hook there. But now it's time to take a look and see about the kitty cat <laughs> that we have up for grabs here. And take a look here. That is a what do they call it? domestic medium here. Uh -huh. This one that is Penny. You can check out Penny over at the Animal Rescue League main office. Yes, and Penny, um, she's a very, very cute um, cat. She loves sitting by the windows and kind of watching the birds, and she will pr probably be better at a Home, calm, calmer home. Um, she's a little shy in the beginning, but when she gets to know you, she loves being petted. Okay, probably not the same home with Timmy. No, no. probably <laughs> not. Yeah, there, Timmy, there's no active home and then calm home. <laughs> How about that? that is great. So, what else is going on at the rescue league? We need to get people caught up with. What yeah, else is happening um, I would love to share with people that we have um, a grant <laughs> for people who uh, live in the 50315 to spay um, for free uh, cats for free, and that includes vaccination and a microchip mm -hmm. and we're actually om almost towards the end of the grant so we only have a few spots left so take advantage so of take that. advantage of it yeah and yep. now what do they need to do to, to take advantage of this they just need to call the rescue lead is yep. a form to fill out what do they have to do yeah there is actually a few ways to do it um, you can go to a website um, and you can find an application that you can fill out online and submit it we'll receive it and give you a call back or you can call our uh, pet snip line mm -hmm. uh, and the phone number and everything it's on the website so I know a lot of people might think rescue leagues like the ARL again this is one of the greatest organizations in the country uh, is mainly like dogs like Timmy or cats like yep. Penny we just saw Penny but you guys have a lot of other animals there too don't you? yes we do we definitely do we have uh, barn animals and small animals like bunnies and uh, rats and hamsters and, and things occasionally like that. you have turtles you have iguanas yeah, uh, you know, in, uh, you mentioned barn animals like roosters. I've seen roosters in yeah. there, but the barn area is really kind of a neat area too. Yes, it is pretty Very cool. Very unique as well. Yeah, we're actually having our main event tomorrow. It's sold out, but um, it's a fundraiser too for the the barn animals, mm -hmm. pretty much. So. It's yeah. a lot of fun. They have been out to the Animal Rescue League and seen this outstanding facility that we have here in Central Iowa. Other rescue leagues in the country are looking at the Animal Rescue League of Iowa to say, you know, this is how it's done the right way, which is kind of a neat feeling, isn't it? It is. Now, also, cool. we need to mention uh, you guys are in the running for some money. 
yes. too. And this is very important because we only have a couple of days left on this. That's right. Uh, can you explain what that's all about? Um, you know, to be honest, if the people want to find out a little bit more about it, um, our Facebook page is the best way, and we are doing reminders every day, and there is a link because people can actually vote every day. And for the shelter of the year, and the Animal Rescue League is in a handful of shelters. They whittled them all down mm -hmm. to a handful of shelters. There's no brainer that Animal Rescue League was going to be one of them, but we have until, I think it's Wednesday, Tuesday or Wednesday, week, to yeah. vote. You can vote once a day. You can put reminders on there, but go to the Animal Rescue League Facebook page and vote for the Animal Rescue League of Iowa for the shelter of the year in the country, and you guys have a chance to win $25,000. Yes, we're very excited about yeah, it. Which we, would go to a good cause. Definitely. And, and be able to help a lot, wouldn't it? Yes, definitely. All right, let's get some more stats here one more time yep. on Timmy. Look how he calmed down. Told you guys. He was just very excited to yeah. see everybody. Okay. Here, Timmy, one um, <laughs> but he's a three-year-old American um, bull terrier and um, just a bouncy, happy guy, loves to play ball, um, knows how to sit, lay down. Um, will prefer or it will be better to be in an adult only home. Yeah, he's just real strong. Yeah, he's, he's just strong. a strong guy. He doesn't know his for own sure. strength. Yeah. yeah, for sure. Okay. Um, and will be definitely benefit for classes just to learn a little bit more and, and to bond with his family. But um, just overall, really, really fun guy. Yeah, and in case you say, oh, those dogs are really mean, wait till you see the, uh, the picture we're going to post here in a little bit because we got a selfie with Timmy look in my face so <laughs> very fun and then the kitty that we have here today is Penny, Penny. Uh, so if you're looking for a medium short hair uh, medium hair cat that's the way to go to and that's that one you'd want in a d different household a quiet household yes and um, it, she's actually from the class as well so that's kind of a perk for some people mm -hmm. um, but yeah loves very very lovey and just calm likes to just watch the birds through uh, the window. So, uh, more information: arl iowaorg Yes, right. Wonderful. Good to see you. Yeah, good to see you too. All right, Timmy, we're gonna get you home. Okay, buddy, you be good. We'll be back. You're watching Great Day Live on KC.